Hello everyone. So in this video, let us talk about how to get a job in UK. Now the easiest way to move to UK is to find a company that can sponsor you for job. And this is especially true after Brexit. Before Brexit, anyone from European Union was allowed to come to UK, live here, do business or find a job. But after Brexit, the rules are same for everyone. If you are from India or if you are from uh, anywhere in Europe, you need uh, to get a sponsored job. Now, in this video, I want to focus on uh, how to get a job. Now, the first thing that I will uh, say is that you should not underestimate yourselves. I know a lot of people, I know a lot of good people, they are really good in what they do, but uh, they think they are not good enough. So, if you have skills and if you have experience, which I believe is the most important thing for getting a job in UK, then you should just uh, apply. You never really know. You might get a response back from the company. And when you search for the jobs, you can always uh, filter based on uh, the on the companies or on the jobs where uh, the company is willing to sponsor the uh, employees from outside UK. And uh, I would say to make your profile stand out, you should try to focus on uh, getting really good in one thing. And uh, that one thing could be any skill. For example, for me, it is uh, definitely Atlassian tools. For example, I am uh, really good in uh, Jira. And uh, if I have to apply for a job, I don't really think uh, the company would say no to me. I mean, I, I can't really imagine a company that would not want to hire me. Now, you should have a very simple but uh, detailed uh, resume or profile or CV. Mention all the things that you have done in your career. And uh, also at the same time, I think uh, in 2022, you should have a very strong online presence. I think that is really important. That will really uh, help you out. For example, if uh, your potential employer is uh, trying to find you online or if they Google your name and if they can find you Maybe they can find your website. Maybe they can find your GitHub profile. Maybe they can find your YouTube channel or the work that you have done. Then I think uh, that will really uh, help you a lot. And of course, uh, if you have done some work uh, in your field, like let us say you have open source projects or maybe you have built something, then show it on your resume or also mention it in your cover letter. So your GitHub profile, if you have one, uh, I think you should all have one, by the way. And having a website is probably the most important thing. You should definitely have your own website where uh, you can uh, list each and everything that you have been doing. For example, you should try to write a regular blog post. You should also try to list the work that you have been doing because on your resume, on your profile, on your CV, you can't really write each and everything. But if you have a website, that is your place. And at the same time, I think uh, having a YouTube channel really helps a lot. I mean, you don't have to... Uh, create videos uh, I mean just for the sake of it but if you can do that I think that will really help you a, a lot in uh, making your uh, you know presence felt in the industry and to be honest nobody cares about your uh, you know Twitter followers or LinkedIn followers it is more about the work that you have done I mean if you can do something else like maybe writing a book that would be wonderful I mean of course uh, if, I, if I talk about myself I was never really a college uh, topper but uh, I have a lot of other things that I have been doing in the last 20 years that has uh, given me this uh, extra benefit <laughs> because uh, if uh, someone is trying to hire me, they can uh, see that, yes, Ravi has written uh, books. Yes, Ravi also has a YouTube channel and Ravi has also been uh, running uh, his own company. So these things, uh, I think, really help a lot. And uh, I think in, in, in the end, I would say that there are no shortcuts. You have to work hard. And uh, it is not really impossible. It is definitely possible to get a job uh, in UK, but uh, you have to basically work for it. You have to make sure that uh, you plan things uh, accordingly. And by the way, if you need uh, my help, feel free to message me on LinkedIn or maybe you can raise a ticket on my support channel. If you go to ravisagar.in slash support, you will find uh, a way to reach out to me. So that is all. Bye-bye.
So I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.